We've been dealing with the heat here in Albuquerque. Of course, we did have that storm in the northeast heights yesterday, but all of the temperatures so far for the month of August are well above average. Our average high 90 degrees and you see 98 on the first day, 95 the second day, 96 the third day, 97, 95 the past couple of days. So well above average today. No exceptions could be another hot one out there for today in the next several days. Storms favor the north for now, but I do think we'll have some better rain chances late week Thursday into Friday. 73 Albuquerque on this Tuesday morning, 66 in Santa Fe, 72 in TRC and 71 in Las Cruces. Right now, the heat dome hanging over the northern parts of New Mexico to southern Colorado. That's kind of circulating some recycled monsoon moisture. I think it's going to miss us for today in Albuquerque, so just hot. 97 the high, 7 degrees hotter than average for this time of year. That storm chance will bring the threat of some excessive rainfall that could lead to flooding across the far north into the Four Corners region for today. You can see that with future track across New Mexico that we'll see those storms across the northern areas up around Taos and even around Farmington into southern Colorado around Durango, Chinle and back toward Gallup and Grants elsewhere. Just hot 102 in Roswell this afternoon, 98 in Carlsbad, 90 in Silver City, 97 Socorro. And tomorrow I think we'll see that best storm chance across the north and west once again. That could extend into the southwestern parts of New Mexico for the first day of school. 97 Albuquerque. Of course, first day of school for APS 90 in Santa Fe and 105 in Roswell for tomorrow. Again, limited storms mainly across the north and west. Better storm chances Thursday across the north. That does include the Albuquerque metro area, and that will linger into Friday as well. So we'll see a little bit better shot at some storms out there. And you see the heaviest rainfall of the next five days near that Colorado state line, and uh, some of that could bring some flooding for sure. Farm to the Four Corners, Durango, Chinle, Gallup, and Grants. Isolated scattered storms today the next several days. Staying hot, though, in the mid to upper 90s through Thursday, maybe back into the lower 90s by Friday. Southwest New Mexico pretty quiet for today, but I do think we'll see those storm chances returning Silver City as we get into tomorrow and Thursday. Those temperatures holding in the lower 90s. Staying dry for Ridoso, Alamogordo, Roswell, Carlsbad, Hobbs, Fort Sumner for today. Just hot out there. 102 in Roswell today, 105 dangerous heat Wednesday, Thursday. Take it slow and easy. Stay hydrated. Never leave the pets or kids in the cars. Raton, Las Vegas, Moriarty, a pretty quiet day for today. Upper 80s in Las Vegas and then better rain chances Wednesday to Thursday. Notice those temperatures dropping back to the lower 80s for highs in Las Vegas by Friday. And for Santa Fe, Taos, the northern mountains of New Mexico, this is where we'll see the best chance of storms, especially near the Colorado state line for today. I think your storm chances in Santa they will go up Thursday into Friday and those temperatures coming back down into the middle 80s by Friday and for Bernalillo, Rio Rancho, Los Linus and Blint. Yeah, it's going to be hot out there. Upper 90s for today to near 100. So 97 Albuquerque today, the first day of school tomorrow, 97 degrees. You see the records are in the low 100, so we're close to that. Low storm chances the next couple days, but our storm chances go a little bit higher for Thursday and Friday, trying to bump those temperatures down to the lower 90s briefly by Saturday. Todd and Royal.